california ms harman for three minutes thank you mr chairman listening to chairman barton i'm starting to believe that maybe the political polar ice cap on this committee is starting to melt at least the beginning of his statement implied that but i just wanted to know and i i was chatting with my colleague mr doyle that some of us all the way over here also think we need to do what we can with hydrogen and build the infrastructure and we need to explore safe uses of nuclear power in our future so just maybe we'll move along smartly here i do however want to endorse the cap and trade idea strongly for c o two we heard from former vice president gore last week that cap and trade program is a time tested means of harnessing the market to reduce emissions and reduce emissions we must i think there is by growing bipartisan support on this committee about that but i agree too that how we design a cap and trade program for c o two is crucial i can envision a carbon market that is rigid unpredictable and inefficient that would be bad but i can also envision a market that is liquid flexible and allows our economy to a cope with to cope with emissions reductions in a way that makes us the example to the rest of the world the decisions made in this room in the coming months will make the difference and the stakes are huge on tuesday i said we should use the power of the american economy as the as the engine for our cap and trade system opening our carbon market could be the carrot that brings the developing nations to the cap and trade table the upside is obvious last year much to the chagrin of uh... uh... many republican and blue dog uh... colleagues in this body the u s uh... had a trade deficit of over eight hundred billion dollars a carbon market could mean that our nation could fill that gap by exporting carbon credits if developing nations want to sell us credits and american businesses want to sell their own credits overseas american ingenuity can win and so can our fragile environment i just want to close by saying that i'm bullish on american ingenuity and bullish on the potential of this committee uh... to get it right if we work together have open minds and learn from the experience on cap and trade i yield back the balance of my time thank you very much ms harman the